Welcome back to another Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl Arcade playthrough. I thought Toph was my best time, but nope, I uh, still Sandy by 20 seconds. We're now moving on to the last Avatar character, Korra. I think she's from Avatar, she's right next to- yeah, I think Korra was the continuation of Avatar if I recall. I don't know anything about it. Wow, Brandon's tipping right off the bat. But what I do know about Korra when I went into training mode, all I can say is that uh, she feels like the Captain Falcon slash Ganondorf character. She has the down kick B, the Falcon punch, the up grab, the, uh, like everything. Everything is just, it just screams Ganondorf slash Captain Falcon. Ooh, that, that noise. Enough talk! We'll teach you to be happy. Oh, I guess they both said that. Ready, yeah, that's that's two, all tough. One, or, I'm sorry, Korra. Six. Reminds me of... Just, uh... Ganondorf... Oh, wow. Her recovery is insane. Yeah. Oh, I gotta be careful with that. Yeah, I gotta be real careful with that. I realized I can go off the stage. But yeah, if you do that in the air... Save Falcon Kick! Get out of here. Perfect. She is big too. She's a big beefy girl. Wow, she got multi-hit combos. I like it. I said I went into training mode for a little bit. I usually when it comes to like platform fighters, and look at that, that's the Ganondorf move. Or Spike. Falcon Spike, you can do it with fire. But yeah, here's the Falcon Punch. Too bad it didn't KO Ren and Stimpy. A bunch of jerks. Damn it, boys! Come on! Oh wow! Her moves can be charged to have elemental attacks to it. I just realized. That's cool. Like in the air, especially because you can do a fiery one or just a normal one. Interesting. <laughs> There's that scream. Come up here. No, we're not. There's that scream again. Up, so Daisy. That leaves me wide open. I gotta be careful. Ren and Sippy have always given me trouble in these playthroughs. Get out of here. Now then, who's next? I get to choose now. I like that. It's like one stage, it's an automatic fight. I don't understand why you have to hit confirm to go to a fight that's just a one thing. Powder Toast Man or Blina, again, on the Loud House stage. She seems to really love that stage. You know what? We've only fought him one time. Let's fight him again. Fingers crossed. Does he say, leave everything to me? In his little text box. I've uh, always wondered that. It's like, like I've mentioned, this is my first time really playing this game. Let's see. My gut's telling me it's time to end this on my terms. Yes! <laughs> leave everything to me. You had to. You had to. It's Powder Three, Toast Man, that's his catchphrase. Two, Besides Powder oh. Toast Man! Ow, wow! That knockback. Get out of here. Man. This game is... Like I said, this game has the potential. But, like I said, the, the fact that it's only catering, technically, to the... Uh, Oh, their competitive scene is a little upsetting. Water uppercut. There's that punch. Oh no! That move can kill you by going off stage there. I thought I would be able to hit him. Wow, Powder Toast, man. There we go. Oh, come on. Get out of here. What's wrong, Mr. President? Cut my zipper! Leave everything to me. Powder. Uh, it's also the, uh, what's wrong there, citizens? We don't have any powder for our powder toast or something like that. It was always silly stuff. I love powder toast, man. I haven't played them yet in this game, though. Get out of here. Whoa. I said, I go into training mode for a little bit. Learn the character's moves. I was really hoping he KO himself. 
been would have been hilarious. Ow. Oh, what? Where am I? Oh, there I am. I thought I was Powder Toast Man for a second. I really hope Powder Toast Man's good in this game. Because I'm actually can't wait to get to him. Because so far the last character I had fun with well actually no, I had fun with Toph. Toph was a lot of fun. Sandy was okay. SpongeBob was fun. I did not have any fun with Aang just because I had to continue. But, um, so far, I, li I like Korra. She's like I said, she's just basically Captain Falcon, but with charge moves. So basically, Captain Falcon turning into Ganondorf. <sighs> Leonardo. Korra versus Leonardo. Hopefully, Leonardo's good too. I know I saw before the patch, Michelangelo was the most broken character. He had like an infinite, right? He was actually banned from a tournament, I saw. Like, uh, Michelangelo's banned. Can't use him. <laughs> my gut's telling me it's time to end this on my terms. Cowabunga! Ready? That should be Mikey's quote. Three, Leo barely two, said that. One, then again, this is 80s Leo. Go. Get out of here, you bastard. Get, get out of here. Falcon! Punch! Gotta stop going for that. Falcon kick! <laughs> Damn it, Leo. That's right, get out of here. There it is, that's his uh, TMMT tournament fighter move. The endless screw or something like that. It's so cool they gave him that. Like, like I said, they gave Mikey a reference to the uh, 80s opening. And I think they also gave him a move from Tournament Fighters as well. It's a nice little callback. Wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. It's a gravestone. Apparently there are hazards. I like this stage. Maybe because of the gothic architecture, but I like it. It, it has very little hazards, which is just the tombstones rising up. I can't tell if they do damage, though. Falcon kick! Uh, falcon kick! Got falcon kick! Leo, if you're gonna KO me, KO me, you bastard. Not so. Get out of here, get. Uh, uh oh. There you go, finally. I'm proud of you, Leo. Really proud of you. Get out of here. That's right. Get out. He's done. And. Oh. I thought he was going to make it. <laughs> Who's next? Come on, baby. Sandy or Top? I am not going to that damn stage again. I am not going. We'll go to Bikini Bottom because Sandy is in Bikini Bottom. But I am not going to that damn Rugrat stage again. If I can avoid it, I'm not going to it. Same thing with Glove World. That Spongebob stage, or oh, I'm sorry, that Rugrat stage has been bad to me. Man, I got a good feeling about tonight. I could take care of myself, after all. Who's the strongest critter in Bikini Bottom? Ready? The strongest critter in Bikini Three, Bottom. Two, you disgusting one, rodent! Go. Yeah! Damn it! Damn it, Sandy! Ooh, that was a nice combo. Sandy. Sandy, that's enough. She just grabbed me out of my punch. I did a falcon. She hit me out of my kick. I did a falcon punch and she's like, nope. Wee. Damn it, Sandy. Get out of here. Sandy. That's enough. Punch. No. <laughs> it's another upper. Sandy! Damn it. Gotcha. Damn it. Get, get. No! Damn it, Sandy, she got the first kill. It's never good. Aha! I got nothing. Okay, Sandy. You wanna play rough? I can play rough. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Oh no! Uh, I gotta stop going for the punch. Will you stop jumping, please? My god. 
Sit down, Sandy. Get out of here. Get. Okay, apparently her punch beats out mine. Why does that not kill? Got her! Alright, Sandy. Maybe I should have gone... My god, maybe I should have gone to the Rugrat stage. No, I got this. Ready? I just gotta block more and hit Sandy more. Oh, I thought the... Wow. I thought that was an item spawning over there with the little flash. But there's no items in this game. What the hell? Get out of here, Sandy. Thank you! I tied it up, basically. Almost. Ow. Aha. No. No. Sandy. I forbid this. Hiya. Hopefully that did not get on. What do you call there? The microphone. I had to sneeze. That's why you heard me cut out real quick. Man. It's getting stuffy. Sandy. Sandy, get out of it! Get out of here. I should have KO'd. Come on, Toph. You're, you're freaking... Ganondorf. Oh, got her! Suck on that, Sandy. Sandy Cheeks. Ha! Show you. Who's the real karate expert around here? Who's next? April O'Neil at the Technodrome. Nice! Cora versus April O'Neil. Cora is, like I said, she's huge. She's big. Like her model. I wouldn't expect her to be like a beefy girl. Is this the first time we've been on the Technodrome? I'm the Avatar. You gotta deal with it. This is April O'Neil on the top floor. Oh, I see a. I see another platform up there, April. You silly girl. No, I think we. I think we were on the uh, Technodrome before. I think so. Get out of here, April O'Neil. Ah! Falcon kick, baby. Come on, April. Show me what you got. Get out of here. Wow, this techno music for the techno drone. Get it? Oh, I tried to do this smooth uppercut there. April. <laughs> April, please. Got her with the uppercut at least. <laughs> that move seems like it does nothing. But that move, on the other hand, is a falcon punch. Aha! She couldn't make it to the platform, the silly guy. Hey, Krang! Why aren't you in the game? Right, you, this is this is Nickelodeon, not Ninja Turtles. Almost, the crane wasn't even in Smash Up. Why? Technically, a, a drama, a, a Dominator. I forget the character's name. TMNT Smash Up. Ooh, Dominator! Oh my God, did they get the same voice actor in this that they had in a uh, Smash Up? Aha! April, you don't know how to recover, you silly girl. I saw Glove World as one of the options. We're not going to Glove World. I said, if I can avoid the Rugrats and Glove World, I'll be good. I'll be good. So, Zim it is. We haven't really fought Lucy Loud either, have we? But I think we've been on just about every stage. Down. Zim's actually the next character we're playing through arcade mode with. I just realized. I'm the Avatar, and my era is not over yet. Let us rain some doom down on the filthy heads of our enemies! Get ready. I'm ready. Three, two, one. I don't like this stage either, because like I said, it just stays zoomed out like this. And uh, that's, that's not good. And then it does that. Zooms out even more! Get out of here, Zim. Aw. Come on, Zim. What the hell? Show me what you got! Oh, I was hoping that would hit him. What the hell? Oh, God. Yeah! Falcon kick! Oh, 
Great, now it's coming over here. Get up here for a second, Sim. Let, let's fight up here, because I want to... Thank you. Now we can come back down. I can hopefully beat you. Damn it. Stupid, stupid cabbages, bread, and tomatoes, whatever the hell's driving by us. Yeah, I hear Zim. Again, stay here, Zim. Stay right there. There you go, there you go. Yeah! Got him with the cabbages. Yes! You couldn't recover! Perfect. You must recover! It's, it's a rule of Smash Brothers Brawl! This game is based off of that because it has the word Brawl in the title. Get out of here. That's game. He, he ain't making it. Complete. Complete! Who's next? Who's next? Or who's the final? That's you. They don't have a, like a strange boss character. Wow! What are the odds? Cora. Aang as the final boss for Korra. On the Hey Arnold world. Nothing fits better. Double A N G. Bomb, bomb, bomb. So the music's really good in this game. I like it. Here we go, baby. Enough talk! If I try, I fail. If I. Okay, A. Okay, I said enough talk. Come here, Aang! Got the first hit. Get out of here, Aang. This is Arnold's world. Uh, here we go, uh, here we go, uh, Arnold! Helga G. Pataki is the only character they decided from Hey Arnold to put in this! Yeah, they got three Ninja Turtle characters, three SmashBob characters, three Avatar The Last Airbender characters. Three characters based in the Avatar universe. I'm not gonna play. Like I said, I think the roster is... I think the roster was fit nicely. Some strange omissions, I'll admit, but... I like that they decided to do that. Like I said, the other two turtles are not in the game. It's very strange. But instead they had April and rumored to be a certain other turtle's enemy. Yeah, yeah! Dang, you bastard. Come here. Yeah! Damn it, Ang. What is this music, though? Nice shot, Ang. It's a shame I'm better than you. And you know it. Yeah! That. 17 and a half minutes. Ugh, that's pretty bad. Compared to my last one. Actually, no, I think that's actually shorter. Hope you enjoyed this playthrough of Avatar. Ugh. Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl with Korra. Stay tuned. Zim is next. My name is Klinkeroth. I thank you all so much for watching.